Good morning, it's from FloridaLady.net, and I'm Kemp Parr. I'm in Napa Valley at the Silverado Resort, and I'm with Dave Bolton and John Youngbird. You guys doing okay? Yeah, we're doing really well. Very Thank well. you. You guys are with uh, Tom Duffy Company. I want to talk a little bit about your meeting you're having out here and some of your new corporate identity news. Before that, though, just real quick, John, why don't you tell me a little bit about uh, house business? You know, uh, I can happily say it's really good this year. I think like a lot of companies... We budgeted the year not off of the pandemic year 2020, but off of 2019. We're measuring ourselves against 2019. So not only were we well above the pandemic year, but above 2019. So it's real positive. And in spite of some material shortages out there and price increases and freight issues, at the end of the day, you know, we're filling orders and business is booming and we're doing our best to to service our customers. For those listeners that may not be aware of Tom Duffy, you're a, a distributor and you have 29 locations, West Coast region, California, Nevada, and Arizona, right? Correct. And you're owned by the Funston family, and uh, you guys have been together for how many years? 1995, right, Dave? 1995 is when uh, B.R. Funston purchased Tom Duffy Company. Dave, you've actually been here 44 years, is that right? That's correct. You've watched this thing grow into what it is today. It's pretty impressive, isn't it? Yeah, it's been quite a ride. You know, it's been enjoyable expanding into multiple states, uh, being in Nevada and Arizona now, and getting to know the customer base, which is what leads into, you know, what, what we're doing here with Floorsight. Yeah, let's talk about that. We're here for your Floorsight meeting. Tell us a little bit about the history of this event and its purpose. You know, we actually did measure, but technically today could be our 20th Floorsight anniversary, actually, if we stop and think about it. And it was originally started as a dealer program years ago to help out dealers in our market that were not an Abbey or a Carpet One, as an example. And we helped them with shelf talkers and financing and those sorts of things. And then over time, we still continue financing programs for them and things like that. But, you know, we're a very strong commercial company, very strong in multifamily. And so a few years ago, we really decided we need to make sure those customers were involved. So we morphed it from a dealer program into just a true loyalty program and where we offer rebates, obviously for growth incentives. We offer freight deals and reduce freight and we'll call at our locations. And then this wonderful convention, we do a convention every year where our customers, our manufacturers and us get together for two nights and three days. And we do a lot of business. It's a selling show. But then as you saw yesterday, we also have a good time. We all had a nice round of golf yesterday or wine tasting tours for people. And it allows us to get to know our customers and our manufacturers all on a social level as well as a business level. Is this something that your retail dealers sign up for as a kind of a membership organization? That's correct. Yes. They have monthly dues that they pay, but they also earn quarterly rebates to offset those dues and, and beyond. So this is a perk, I guess. They're having this meeting as part, as part of one of the reasons they join, right? They ab- absolutely do. They all enjoy it. The vendors, they really enjoy getting together and getting to know the customer. And we feel that's really important. That's what we've built you know, our business on is, is connecting with our customers. And this uh, floor site, it really helps us build those relationships stronger and you know, keeps them going on into the future as well. You know, I've been here about a day now, and I see the camaraderie. I mean, these guys have grown to be good friends with each other, Mm -hmm. and I'm sure they look forward to this. You know, it's amazing. A lot of these are competitors, <laughs> head-to-head competitors in the marketplace, but they leave that at, at home when they come here. It's, it's amazing, the camaraderie and they, how they help each other, and, you know, whether it's commercial or retail, you see them talking about business on, a, like, a neutral playing field level. It's just really good to see. And, 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 you know, good point, David, not just the customers, but even our manufacturers. You know, we, we even have competing manufacturers here, but people are here really, first and foremost, for the good of the industry. You were gracious enough and come to speak to our group this morning with some really good industry industry data and everybody gobbles that up and it's pertinent to everybody so there is a camaraderie even as an industry too where you put aside some of the rivalry and competitive stuff and we're all here for the good of the business mm-hmm. and tonight you're having an argyle party is that right? we, argyle party yeah we'll see how that goes we we all were given argyle socks yes. in our welcome bags we've got a great band under the stars and uh, it'll be a fun night this is a great resort. It's a lot of fun being here. So a little recent news, new corporate identity, new logo. It's interesting. You're owned by the Funston family, and yet Tom Duffy, I guess, is best known in the marketplace. So you're doing a little bit of a monolithic identity, I guess, and going under the one name and just calling the Tom Duffy company a Funstein company, right? That's correct. You know, if you look at the 29 locations, they all have the Tom Duffy brand on them. B.R. Funston 
uh, started in Northern California, but they really didn't have a presence in the Southwest. We expanded in the Southwest on the Tom Duffy brand. Now with the digital world transformation going on, this is a really important time for us to consolidate the brand and just seemed like it made a lot of sense to our customers in the industry as we continue to grow our company. Yeah, you know, as we work with e-commerce consultants and digital consultants, you, you talked about brand equity and in, in that earlier in your talk too, but even from a search engine standpoint, search optimization, they were able to point out to us that we're going to be much more identifiable and findable on the internet when we have one brand and one name. And so we took heed in that and uh, that's what we did. And we're, we're really happy about it. And I can tell you all the employees are thrilled because through the years, some employees felt they were BR Funston employees still to this day. And some felt they were Tom Duffy employees, even though it was a management team and ownership felt we were one company now. And so the, the, the employees have been thrilled to know that, oh, this is the plan. This is where we're heading. And they are thinking about those things. And our logo says, I believe it says one company, one focus, one goal. And I think our company is already buying into it in the two days that we've announced it. Congratulations on having this great meeting out here. It's good to spend time with you again. But talking to Dave Bolton and John Youngbird with Tom Duffy Company. And you've been listening to Kempar and FloridaLA.net.